But the most important one mm. for the married ones. When you take it for three days, ah, yeah, yeah. For me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my ah, see, god. The soup is even she's pouring. Yeah. Wow. It's even pouring. Let me give yes. you the big one. <laughs> Hi, Hi guys. guys. Welcome, Welcome back to our channel. YouTube channel. Yeah. How are you we are making a video about this fruit. We want to tell people about this fruit, honey. Mm -hmm. Did you know that many people don't know yeah. this fruit and the it's, benefit it has? Yeah, it's a very rare fruit. And we decided it's not rare, actually. It's, it's a common fruit. No, it's rare, like especially where we live. Mm -hmm. People don't usually get to see this kind of fruit every day. Mm. Yeah, that's why we are making a video about it. Yeah, this is the reason as to why we rarely make videos. <laughs> every time we say hi, guys, our everyone boys, wants to be in the video. <laughs> everyone, I think you can tell everyone is here. They want to be in the video. It's okay, we can leave them. Eh? Mm. Okay, that's Manuel. Manuel, say hello. 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 This is a Is it say hello? Hello. <laughs> I think it's because we are in a developed area. You rarely find this plant in people's homes. Yeah. Yeah, there are not many gardens around, but if you go in the markets, especially in the city, mm. you'll find these streets and also ladies hawking them on the streets. Yeah. But unfortunately, not many people buy this fruit, they just pass by it but yet. It is packed with a lot of healthy benefits. It's, it's because people don't know that. Okay, the, the fact that it's not a common fruit, mm. people also don't know. Like, mm. they don't find it tasty. Mm. Yeah, but it's really a good fruit. Actually, to me, this is one of the tastiest fruits in the world. It tastes so, <laughs> like, it's so different. Yeah, it has a sweet taste. It has a white pulp yeah. inside. And uh, first of all, before you go into that, let's tell them the, the name of the fruit. Yeah. How so, do they call it? The fruit is called guanabana. Yeah. English, it is called? A sour soap. Yeah, sour soap. Some call it sour soap. And then in, in our local language, in Uganda, it is called? We call it a uh, chita fairy. A chita fairy. Mm. Or a chita fairy. Yeah. So let us know how you call this fruit in your local language, in your native yeah. language, in the description down, sorry, in the comment section down below. Yeah. Yeah, so this fruit, we are going to prepare, so we are going to open this fruit, but before you do that... These boys are happy, they, are, they can't <laughs> wait for us to cut it. Yeah, so it has a white pulp inside, and uh, you can make uh, smoothies. Actually, people make smoothies and juice out yeah, of it. Juice, smoothies, yeah. ice cream from it, ice cream Definitely, flavors yeah. in restaurants. And guys, to this, this fruit... Treats almost 99% mm -hmm. of the ailments we have, of the diseases we have. Tell me about it, because me, I really don't, I, I if, don't know. If you make research, mm -hmm. if you go online, mm -hmm. this fruit is packed with a lot of medicinal properties. Okay. Let me tell you, God created this world uh, as humans and everything around us, most of the things around us are medicine, but we don't Definitely. Know. Yeah, like the, all the food. Yeah, all the food. Medicine, yeah. So this is one of the miracle plants we have. Guanabana. Yeah. Sorry, our son has tried to pierce his little finger <laughs> through the fruit. Because it's ready to eat. Yeah, it's ready to eat. Yeah. Ah, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> so it has got a lot of medicinal properties. Honey, yeah. do you know any? Well, I've heard that it 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 treats um, high blood pressure, mm -hmm. and um, it also decreases the chances of getting uh, is it called diabetes, mm -hmm, diabetes. Some, um, something like that. Mm -hmm. Also, cancer. Mm -hmm, you're right. But I really, I'm I'm not sure about that. I've just read about it. Mm -hmm. I've not seen it working for anyone. So mm -hmm. easy stopping. Mm -hmm. That's what I've heard. What about you? Yeah, this fruit uh, can also boost your immunity. Really? Yeah, mm -hmm. when you take it for three days, it will hype it up. Okay. We talked about hypertension and many, many, but the most important one mm. for the married ones, mm -hmm. this fruit. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you for real? <laughs> <laughs> this is one of I the fruits which improve your blood circulation. Oh, really? 
Yeah, and as you know, as a man, when your blood circulation is very good, mm. everything will be nice. And, wow, uh, you know. it's a kid. Oh my god, this boy is okay. <laughs> everything will move smoothly and uh, definitely. When you go for the for the game. For the game. Mm. Oh my god, <laughs> <laughs> the boys are gone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you now feel calm. <laughs> These guys yeah, can disturb. They are always on my neck. So. The fruit has seeds mm. inside. They are brown in color. Some yeah. are black, depending, I think, on the species. Yeah. And it's a perennial plant. It's an evergreen tree. Yeah. It it bears fruits through throughout the year. Yeah. yeah. So it is very very advisable to have it in your garden. Sorry, in your backyard at home in your small garden. Yeah. The tree doesn't put up a lot of. The tree doesn't put on a lot of branches. It's a very minimal tree, but it brings a lot of fruits. You eat these fruits throughout the year. The year. Let me tell you, if you have this fruit regularly, mm -hmm. it will be very rare for you to visit a doctor. Okay. I saw this with my grandmother. <laughs> you, you know, it has reminded me of this. Uh, is it a proverb yeah. that an apple a day yeah. keeps, Take, the doc keeps the doctor away? The doctor away. Exactly. So should we replace it with this guanabana? <laughs> yeah, actually, the guanabana is has more health benefits than an apple. Uh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, it has more health bene the benefits mm. than an apple. Yeah. So we go ahead and open the fruit. Yeah, let's cut it. But before it's doing me, that, I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait. I really love it. Yeah, but yeah. before that, we are going to first wash, wash the fruit. It. Yep. You don't need my help. Uh, let me help you for today. <laughs> <laughs> you always uh, look after us. So let me help you. Okay. This. So I should just wait to eat it. Eh? Yep. Okay. So you have to watch it thoroughly because mm. you don't know if especially if you bought it in the market you don't know which hands it go through where it was grown yeah they re they actually these fruits they don't spray them but you never know yeah yeah there are some species which it goes, are, it goes through a lot of parts also exactly yeah and also the dust mm -hmm. you don't want to get that dust because the the, the cover is very very thin yeah. you are most likely to have it when you're eating yes yeah by mistake so after washing it, washing it, you Same don't. Too. You don't actually. Have let's dry it. Dry it. Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we, do we, do we need to? Okay, let me use a serviette. So with this fruit, you don't need a knife. Mm. You just break it because it is very soft. You don't need a knife. And we need to cut it properly. <laughs> properly, you know. We need a yeah. knife. You want yeah. to break it with your hands. Me, I'm going to show you how we used to eat it when we were sitting. And we had these, like, I think, five trees in our garden. Okay. Yeah, you know, I grew up with my grandmother and she had a lot of fruits in the garden. Mm. So we had, I think, even ten, ten of them all over sure. the entire garden because we had several acres of uh, farmland. Okay, so right now. Are you ready? You're just going to break it. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> oh ah, my see, god. The soup is even she's pouring. Yeah. Wow. It's even pouring. Let me give yes. you the big one. <laughs> it looks so good. Hmm? So you can make juice from this. Yeah. You can make smoothies. Ooh. You can get flavors and mix them in the ice cream. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How does it taste? It's really a good one. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Someone is calling me. So this is how the seeds actually Yeah, this like. is how the seed looks like. It's brown. Some are brown, some are dark brown. Mm. Some are black. So, we just peel off the pulp like this and eat like this and eat or you can just use them it's so juicy mm. yeah mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> very tasty very juicy and you want some you don't want okay it is nice for us we are enjoying it <laughs> but it tastes Surprisingly, my nose doesn't like it. 
I don't know why. Mm. And it's not the first time. I don't know why it's he doesn't like it. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's test. You know, it has a rare test. Mm. Have you like? Have you had any tests like anything like this anywhere? Something which wants to come close to it is cocoa. Sure. Have you ever tested cocoa? Mm. The cocoa plant. I feel like this is totally different from the cocoa, the cocoa plant. The cocoa also has white. The inside is like this, though this this one has so much um, soup soup in it, and also it's so juicy. Yeah. Than the cocoa, but the taste is almost similar. Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. I think it's better to eat it like that, like you spray it <laughs> because I feel like my juice is just getting wasted. Natural sugar, no additives, yeah, very healthy. Yeah, mm. it's so juicy. <laughs> I feel like, like actually having to like if we make if we we've made juice out of it, eh? mm. it would really taste so. Good. And also one thing I like about it, the acid levels in it are balanced. Yeah, they're not too much. Unlike the lemons, the oranges, eh? mm -hmm. this one the acid is very minimal. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Look at that. <laughs> mm. Look at this. Manu, reduce your volume. So I think that's it, honey. You Plus didn't, you didn't talk um, much about the, the what it treats. Mm. We did. We did. We did discuss that. Then you get the go, you get the cartoon. Even me, I discussed it. Okay. Mm, I think we can say bye bye to them now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We should not say bye bye because if we put off the camera, mm -hmm. we're going to eat Mommy. this. <laughs> so let's keep, let's keep on. Don't buy this. Okay, now who the Okay. It's really nice, really, really nice. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not giving you. Mm. 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 In Kenya, Rwanda, they say, <coughs> Mezeneza. Chamezaneza. 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 Mm. Mm. So, people, bye bye. <laughs> you say bye. Mm. Okay, thank you guys for watching this video. It was quite a short one, but we needed to let you guys know mm. about this. Because people usually take it, take this fruit for granted. Yeah, actually, some people don't even know about this fruit. Mm. So thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.